there are actually lots of editors along the way, and this is something a lot of readers don't realize. Um, but I, in my other life, I am an editor of journalism, so I, I know a little bit of the process. When I'm done writing a book, when I finish a draft, or I think of maybe a second or third draft, I give it to my personal editor, who is my husband. <laughs> I married my editor, um, and he's terrific. What makes him a good editor is that he tells me what's wrong. Um, he makes sure to tell me first what's right, but after that he tells me what's wrong. And he's always right, inevitably always right. Um, so I get defensive and angry, and I tell him he's an idiot, and then I go home and think about it and realize that, of course, he was right, and I spent another six months revising the novel based on his notes. That's just to get it to my agent, who then goes through and makes his own notes. And I like his edits. They're also very tough, but that's why I trust him as my agent, because I feel like he's reading my book thoroughly. If I had an agent who just said, here's the manuscript, yeah, thanks a lot, I don't really need to read it, I trust you, I'll send it out. I wouldn't want that agent. I want an agent to tell me how to make something better. Then by the time you get to your publisher, if you've already gone through those steps, you hope there isn't that much left to do. Um, that there might be questions about, I'm not sure about this scene, uh, this character's motivation in this part didn't seem to quite make sense. Could you clear this up? I'm confused about this relationship. But relatively minor stuff. You don't want, by the time you go to a publisher, your editor at that publishing house shouldn't be saying, uh, this character should die and that man should be a woman and this should be set in Zimbabwe and they should be astronauts. It, by that point, it, it, you don't want whole overhauls. But an editor is essential because an editor wants to make your work better. A good editor is one who makes, who understands what you're trying to do as a writer and helps you do that better. A bad editor is someone who changes what you're trying to do. But a good editor will, will take your own project and make it something that's clearer and still your own project. And if it's, if it's done well, by the time you get to the finished product and read your finished book, you won't be able to remember which parts your editor suggested you add and which parts you always had in from the beginning. They'll blur in your mind because they're so organically connected. That's what a good editor can do. Thank you for listening. Please review our other available content for help writing, publishing, and marketing your book. If you have any questions about the Author Learning Center, please contact us by email at authorsupport at authorlearningcenter.com.